So, full time at the Emirates and a youngster has come off the bench and absolutely spun that game on its head. He done more in 35 minutes in that football match than Theo Walcott's done in about a season. So, so direct, direct, unbelievable. Just seeing a kid with that much confidence just absolutely running at people, scaring the shit out of them. Before that, it was absolute dog shit. Theo Walcott is the most brain dead footballer I have ever seen in my life. When he gets a chance to shoot, he passes. When he gets a chance to pass, he shoots. He's born offside. Um, and I just don't get how he is still getting a first team slot in this team. But that being said, you know, we move on, we're through to the next round, and that's the most important thing. You know, and it, the way I see it as well, this boy came off the bench. <laughs> he came off the bench and he spun the whole game and he got the crowd lifted, the crowd were dead. You know, he got everyone buzzing their tits off and fair play to him, man. He's going to go home absolutely over the moon tonight and so he should be. And in my opinion, he should be straight into that first team for the Swansea game at the weekend. Other than that, it is what it is. You know, other performers tonight, there weren't really that many. Jack did well, I thought, I thought he tried. Um, everything he tried was direct. Why are we playing four players out of position in the back five, though? It's disgraceful. But tonight's not really a night for moaning and bitching and whinging it was a completely changed team i thought De silver done well when he came on as well um quite quick as well but yeah the star of the show tonight was enketia so fair play to him um fair play to them for digging in and getting the goals as well because norwich should have been should have had us dead and buried in reality so yeah we move on anyway subscribe like share i'm out of here peeps laters